Hello, welcome back to a new video. So I want to show you my loadout for Automaton Solo Helldive missions. We're going to do this mission. I'll show you my loadout. Basically, it's just the auto cannon with a bunch of airstrikes. So you've got the 500 kg, you've got the airburst, and also the laser and reinforcement budget. But mainly, this is an auto cannon build. And for our equipment, we're going to be using the... Hmm, I actually kind of like the Scorcher for this build. And also for grenades, I think the thermite is pretty good, but the stun grenade is also pretty good for stunning some of the tougher enemies in the game so you can shoot them with the auto cannon. And for this armor, we got reduce range at which enemies detect you by 30%. So yeah, we're ready to go. Okay, so first of all, I was going to call down my auto cannon, but we're getting jammed. So first of all, move away from the jammer, maybe. So yeah, I really like the, what's it called? The Scorcher for taking out automatons, 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 how do you say it? It's actually really good because it does kind of like a knockback explosion and it can basically kill a lot of these enemies. I mean, including this walker guy, look. Usually they're pretty well armored on the front, but with this you can actually take them down by shooting them in the front. And the Senator pistol is pretty good for these guys. Since it's medium armor penetrating, it does quite a lot of damage. So you can do a headshot like that, and then these guys get one shot. And then the stun grenade is really good for stunning groups of enemies like this, and then you can just kind of pick them off pretty easily. But watch this, watch. Look, they're all stunned. And then you pick them off with the Scorcher. Oh my god. Okay, so I finally got rid of the signal jammer. I can finally get the auto cannon. So basically, this whole loadout and build playstyle revolves around the auto cannon because because of that. Basically, you can like one, two shot almost any of these robots. I don't really want to engage with those people over there. So we're just going to go this way. I think it's a pretty versatile uh, build and playstyle because you got the offensive capabilities of this. So you could like nearly one shot them. That was like two shots, I guess. Three shots on that thing. And then you can also take out these turrets if you shoot them in the back enough times. See, three times in the back of turrets will take out those turrets. And if you shoot hulks in the eye twice, that's usually enough to take them out. So yeah, it's pretty good, pretty strong. I don't know if you can take out the fabricators. Uh, probably not a good idea. Oh my god. I am out of ammo. <laughs> and that's where the Scorch comes in to nearly save you, but... Oh, I just got it. That was close. Who's that over there? Oh, that's a tree. So reload the auto cannon. Uh, right, so what you do is you want to use the Scorcher against smaller people like that. And then save the auto cannon for devastators and hulks and other things. But usually the scorcher is good enough for taking out the light armored people. Oh my god. Did they see me? I don't think they saw me. You see, that's why you want that trailblazer armor. Oh wait, I'm supposed to do the objective here. This is my thing is jammed. And they're coming. And I've got no orbitals. Oh, there's a jammer over there, that's why. So here's what you can do: stun grenade. Auto cannon in the face. Oh, I got the Hulk. And then mop up the rest. That is the basic play style of this build. The stun grenades really are useful to give you a chance to aim the auto cannon. Oh my god, up there. See, the scorch is pretty damn good. And you can finish it off with a. A senator in the head. A senator's pretty damn good too. I mean, all the weapons are pretty damn good. That's why I'm saying this is a really good loadout for automatons. That was not good. Those rocket devastators, they really hurt. Oh. If you shoot it in the rocket pod, that usually does a lot of damage. Okay, just reload everything. I think I wiped out that whole group. There's another group over there. Oh my god. Get a stun grenade. Oh, there's loads over there too. 
Oh, two shot. I think they got me though. Oh, oh my god. I'm out of med kits. Oh, there's enemies over there. Yeah, I'm screwed. I don't have any stratagems to use because of the signal jammer. I don't know if those guys can see me. I need to get this signal jammer down, but I can't call anything. Yeah, look at this. They can't detect me, probably because i got this armor on. That reduces detection range by 30%. It's so useful. And then watch this. You can, like, snipe them with the auto cannon. Headshot. Chest shot. What else? Get this little guy too. I don't think that patrol. Oh, spoke too soon. I think the patrol did see me. Yeah, I guess they can hear you. Can I get into the base? I feel like I'm a sitting duck if I run out there. Something's shooting at me. Oh, oh, the walker thing. Oh, they just dropped off. See, it's also good against small guys because of the explosive. I'm going to get shot here. Uh, that was really tough. So I'm going to try land near the... Oh, I should have landed on the fabricator. Got to disable this damn thing. Where is it? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. The scorcher is good too because it's got like a little stagger. Staggering effect. Oh my god. Punch him in the face. I don't know why I'm, I'm spawning with only two medkits. Must be some kind of deep... Oh, I killed myself! The explosion. He just ran out of nowhere. Okay, so if I could land on the signal thing, I could blow it up, couldn't I? Oh, I nearly got the fabricator. There's loads here. What? Where did those come from? They're just coming from everywhere. Oh, I failed. Well. Well, that wasn't very good, was it? I could try again. Didn't think I'd go through so many lives that quickly. Well, it is a good build. It's just the problem is this mission was a real bitch with all the signal jammers. Okay, let's try again. This time, play a bit more carefully. Although that last mission was such a mess. Really couldn't find anywhere safe to take out targets. But we got a new mission, new friends. Oh, it's terminates, not automatons. Oops. It's weird. I swear I went on automatons, I pressed join match. And now I'm in a terminate mission. Uh, okay, whatever. It's supposed to be automaton killer loadout, but I guess it could work for terminates. Pretty much the same thing. I don't know if you can kill the. Bio Titans with it. Maybe. Maybe. Why does this mission look so dull? I can't use this for a thumbnail. I need some colours. It's so bland looking. Not a good mission.